So I usually wake up and make myself breakfast, but today my boyfriend actually made me breakfast in bed. So I'm gonna have some scrambled eggs, waffles, turkey bacon, and a side smoothie. And of course we can't forget about the prenatal vitamin. Now it's time for a bump check. I am nine months pregnant and soon after I eat, I'm just gonna brush my teeth and get the day started. So now I'm just going to throw on some quick maternity clothes and I'm going to actually take a little walk today and I'm going to be listening to an audiobook called Inner Glimpse. It's just a nice little motivational book to help you get inspired and I love audiobooks because it's just easier to listen than to have all of your attention focused on a book. And I'm just going to grab my water and we're going to go ahead on this walk. So usually when I take my morning walks, I walk my dog, but he is not here today. So I'm just walking by myself and just catching some fresh air, regardless if he's here or not, because I just think it's very important to just get up early and just get some fresh air. While I'm on my walk, my goal is always to finish my full bottle of water before I go inside the house. As soon as I come in for my walk, I love to make a cup of tea just because it's really convenient. Um, we have a tea machine slash coffee machine in my building, so I literally just go there and make myself a cup of tea just to relax before I take my shower and before I start my day. When the weather is nice like it is today, it's not too hot or too cold, I love to just go on the rooftop just to catch some more fresh air. As you can see, I just love getting fresh air and being outside whenever I can because I live in Jersey, so we have to take advantage of this nice weather. So now it's time to take a shower and when I take showers, I just love to set the mood with some relaxing music. And my favorite album to play is Urban Flora by Alina Baraz. And I just love this album because it's so relaxing. I also like to have the bathroom smelling extremely good. I don't know, I just feel like it sets the mood and just makes my mood just way better. So I take this um, room spray by Glam Gray Company and I spray the shower and I turn the shower all the way up so that it's nice and steam and hot and close it so that the scent is enclosed in that area. And then now I'm going in with my rose spray and this is just like regular room spray from Bath and Body Works and I just like to spray the outside of the bathroom. Last but not least, I just like to light a candle. This is just like a eucalyptus scent, but um, any fresh smelling candle does the job. And this just puts the icing on the cake and makes the bathroom smell like heaven. So these are the two primary um, products that I use inside of the shower, a rose water body wash, and a rose sugar scrub. Um, I've just been obsessed with the scent rose lately. I don't know what it is, but I just love that scent. And the sugar scrub is very important when it comes to pregnancy, especially if you're prone to stretch marks. It's good to exfoliate your stomach and your um, other problem areas as like your thighs or like your hips or whatever but I try to exfoliate almost every time I take a shower so I recently just started using this body wash and I am obsessed it is like the perfect aromatherapy and it's very very gentle on your skin and it does the job it smells amazing that is like one of the reasons why I bought it and it has yet to fail me so these are the products that I've been using on my skin as of recently as you can see there's a lot of like oils and stretch mark creams just because I'm trying to keep the stretch marks down to a minimum 
Now I'm gonna go in with the First Aid Beauty Face Cleanser and I'm just gonna cleanse my face as normal. Nothing crazy. So I've been using the Angel Cosmetics Brightening Vitamin C Serum on my face, but I've been having a few breakouts, so I've recently started using the Bloom Meltdown for acne prone skin, and this stuff is amazing, oh my god. I literally had breakouts on my face, and I used this after two days, my breakouts went away, so I've just been sticking to it. So now I'm going to go in with my Laneige Sleeping Lip Mask, and I use this during the day as well. This is what I put on my face at night before I go to sleep to stay hydrated and this is just another lightweight moisturizer I use on my skin during the day. So now I'm going to get into the products that I use on my stomach and on my stretch mark areas. So I use it on my stomach, my thighs, my sides, and um, yeah, anywhere that <laughs> I'm basically stretch mark prone. So I like to start out with my thicker creams first and work my way to my lighter ones. So I'm going to take the um, Shea Butter Body Butter and put it all over my stomach. And then I go over top of it with this bio oil. I love this bio oil. It's been working so great for me. Um, but yeah, everybody's different. And this is just for the rest of my body. This is just some nice rose oil and this smells amazing. I love putting this on my body after I get out the shower and it's just amazing aromatherapy. So sometimes self-care also includes just getting cute, you know, putting on some lashes, doing your makeup, and just feeling extra good about yourself. Especially during pregnancy, you just find yourself not wanting to do anything, not wanting to do your hair, your makeup, not wanting to go out because you're so tired. But this is just a very important part of pregnancy and I just can't stress this enough. Having alone time is great, but just keeping in touch with your friends and family is amazing too. Sometimes you just need somebody to just, you know, sit and talk to, especially during pregnancy when you're extra hormonal. You just need to just get out and socialize. Hey beautiful, what you doing? Let's just get some bubbles here real quick. Oh, okay. refreshing. Oh, nice. <laughs> So to put an end to my self-care day, we kind of just went to go pick out a plant and just feel good about ourselves. I actually got one for my boyfriend because he's very, very into plants. So I found this cute snake plant and it felt good just giving somebody else a gift <laughs> on my self-care day. But yeah, just relaxing, enjoying the day and making the most out of this pregnancy without being stressful is my definition of a perfect self-care day. Also to all my pregnant mamas out there, it is normal to feel down at times during pregnancy, but I hope that the tips that I've shared with you today can help you in the future and just help you, you know, stay positive. Until next time, guys. See you.